All right, so welcome back to um, Saga, Scarlet Grace Ambitions. So I'm kind of determined to learn this like dual wielding ability. I'm not entirely sure where I need to go to do it, but... The people of Rhea don't leave the region at all. The Fae are just jealous of us after all. Shall we save the world together? Hmm. Wait, what? How am I answering for her? Well, trick of the I just recruited Chi Chi. Who I think gives me a new formation. Petal Storm. DP increases upon vanquishing foes. Hmm. Oh no, she gave me Sweeping Strikes, that's the one she gave me. Um, but I've been using Royal Hearts. Oh, the two allies in the front have increased attack power. I didn't even realize that was for that one. Hmm, what does this one do? Longsword text costs fewer BP for the ally in the designated position. BP increases at the rate of one per turn. Use the speed of the lead ally to flight, fight flexibly as the situation requires. Kind of want to do that one. So we need to have... Hold on, our retinue. Mondo, we want to put Urpina back in. Okay, we'll try this formation. This might actually be not too bad. Um, but we still need to figure out where we're going to learn our dual wielding. So we're just aimlessly going to all these... There's been an endless stream of bad fellows trying to capture Faye lately. We've been trying to chase them away, but they just keep coming. What do they hope to do with captured Faye? Sell them, I reckon. At a high price, too. They think themselves so high and mighty, even going by the name Faye Energy. Believe me, it's darn unforgivable. I believe the Fey faith is heretical, but capturing and using the Fey is even more unacceptable. If I find them, I shall put an end to this for good. Gosh, man, thanks a heap. Hmm. No, he always asks me this, and never giving up. I thought those were the ones we needed to stop. Um, let's actually check our retinue, and we're going to do our armaments, and we're going to just, um... We're just going through and putting on recommended armaments for everybody, which... Okay. So, let's check out this place, maybe? Plenty of humans out there want the Fae to make their wishes come true, but most times those wishes end up turning sideways on them. Trick of the Fae is what we call it. Like what, for example? Like, some will say their prayers and give offerings, but all they get in return is a heaping pile of smelly shroops. Sorry, this ain't a tale for proper ears like yours. Are you sure that is the work of the Fae and not a gang of children out for pranks and marks? <laughs> you might be right at that. Hmm. So something's going on with the Fae. <sighs> annoying. Stop asking me. Now, have you heard the spooky story of the Fae Bride? Long ago, there was a village that displeased the Sprite and so suffered famine and disease. In order to save themselves, they offered one of the village girls to be the Sprite's bride. Such a terrible thing would never have been permitted during the Imperial Era. Yeah, even in the Imperial Era, these things happen in secret. It's the normal course of things here in Rhea, for we're a poor province. And Inferno calling itself a sprite was here, and it might be here yet. Hmm. I say, have you met any Fae yet? I... I did indeed. 
You must treat sprites carefully, like humans, nay, more, even more than humans. They repay kindness with kindness and ill with ill. So we have access to the Mercenaries Guild. Mercenaries Guild posts a variety of jobs for your allies to undertake in exchange for rewards. Dispatch allies cannot participate in engagements or return with increased skill levels or HP after you have participated in a set number of engagements. Allies with zero LP and certain other allies cannot be dispatched. Okay. Um... Well, let's send out Jan... Wait, what do we... Let's send out Chi-Chi, because she's brand new. Although we do need a longsword user, but... Um... What town haven't we gone to yet? Maybe Feral? I say, do you believe in the Fae? It is heresy to believe heresy to believe in the fear ah my god. It is heresy to believe in fairies and sprites that help people. Only the celestials do so. And the only one who receives their power is the Emperor. Such did I learn as a young child. Perhaps that is how it is for you big city types, but out here on the frontier things are very different. That's why we always and forever be considered a frontier. And once the Empire disappeared, people stopped getting censured for speaking of the Fae. The times certainly are changing. Is it really so bad to believe in the Fae? The people here do not seem terrible sorts. Hmm. It's gonna be just Mondo. Um, leave me alone! Okay, um... The land of Rhea is shaped in very inconvenient ways, so it's long been treated as a frontier. Still, that's not the reason we get to see sprites here and there, so, oh, or that's the reason we get to see sprites here and there, so it's not all bad. It's heretical to believe in the Fae. Also, infernal agents may have found their way here. Oh, we have no intention of defying the Celestials, but it's true that sprites appear here. As fanciful as it seems, perhaps these sprites have something to do with dual wielding. Ooh! It's just gonna be Mondo, yep. Every time. Karuna, maybe? No. Moros? No. Bannon Village? This is but a ruined village, and yet it feels as if someone is here. Ha! Yeah! What an incredible handling of the blade! This might be the person to teach me dual wielding techniques. You there! How dare you gawk at my training! Pray forgive my rudeness, I was so enraptured by how wonderfully you handled the sword that I did not promptly greet you. I am your Pina Gelanius, and I am here to learn the art of dual wielding. Your greeting is for naught. Be gone! Perhaps you know my elder brother Antonius? Did he not learn those self same arts from you? Did you not hear me? Be gone! My apologies for interrupting your training. I take my leave of you. So we are managing to do something. Anyways, there is no doubt that man was Antonius' master. Did Lord Antonius, Lord Antonius tell you out of this? He only said that he was forbidden to speak of his dual wielding training. Perhaps that man ordered his silence as a condition? The possibility certainly is there. However, I think it may prove quite tricky to have him take you on as a student. This is the path Antonius walked and I will simply have to find a way to tread it myself. Could that man be the one called Sprite? Hmm. Now what? No. Uh, no. 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 I'm just going to all the towns. Nope, maybe this thing up here, the water mirror? Nope. Alright, so... Nope. Nope. Hmm. Hmm, I feel like we've gone everywhere. I guess we could talk to her, but... What are you doing? Fishing, I'm a diver, can't you tell? Oh yeah, that's the same thing. Yeah, take us, why not? Maybe it'll pass some time or something. 
And we can try out this new formation too. Spirituals? Let us proceed with caution. Actually, kind of hurt. We managed to actually get a paralysis up on them, so we know they are affected by it. So that's kind of nice to know. Hmm. We can't delay him though. That's fine. We'll just kill it. Eighty-one damage. Oh yeah, because we have that like special bow, so pretty good. Should be able to win no problem now though. We need to use the triple thrust more often though, because we need it to rank up. Oh, I don't even know what what another attack? Oh right, a normal attack. Okay, that's fine. See if that'll work. See if we can get a united attack here. So we're all attacking A. It's gonna be close, although my one dude should do quite a bit of damage to him. Oh, well, Paul and stuff. 79. We did it. Perfect. We get a united attack here. Unite and attack. 79 damage. The reason the united attacks are good though is because. We lowers every the cost of everything else, right? So the problem is, is the only one that's really worth doing is that. Mm -hmm. I guess we can do that, but. That actually really hurt. <laughs> Another united attack. United is great. And, attack. and next turn, our one caster is going to do her move, so that'll be good. I shall finish this. Two off. So. We'll try that. This might work out okay, maybe. Rank up! Place me in the four. I'm pretty happy you ranked up triple stuff. That's great. And hypergravity, we'll get a united attack here for sure. Me first? Very well. Perfect. That was well done. I'll give my all on the front line. I'd rather my arms not get too burly. 
Um, call lightning, I guess. All right, now let's go visit all these towns again. I may just have to visit the abandoned village again. I do not sense anyone here. Hmm. No one's here. He truly does seem like a character who will be difficult to deal with. This That isn't enough to make me give up. Maybe he really is some sort of man or, or blah, 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 sprite if he disappeared like that. Okay. So maybe he's at the fairy stone. Okay, so I just had to go back. Oh, wait a minute. More fairies. Hmm. Hmm. The basket has fallen. E let's open it. What? Oh, there's a wild strawberry inside. Hmm, how lovely. One LP, okay. Okay, so nothing for that yet. Oh, the, the hunters are gone. Hmm. So something has changed. Wait a minute. Oh, he's back here. Specialists in martial and mystic arts occasionally visit palace by training of the willing. If you learn from them, your skill levels will increase. Um, short swords. Okay, let's teach Nesta maybe. Oh, there's a boat here in the middle. Berry hunters. Oh, no. So there's still nothing to do with them. Oh, that looks different. Oh. Image of Mars. Okay. Hmm. Oh, we can enter the cocoon. So you're supposed to go into the cocoon, and my brother did the same, I see. Who is it that you speak to, milady? Uh, fairy, you cannot see it, Mondo? I see nothing. This is clearly infernal trickery. You must not enter the cocoon, milady. Such a thing will certainly not grant you any martial arts skills. All will be well, Wando. Whether or not I'll survive depends entirely on me, but I swear to learn dual wielding and return alive. Do not do this thing, milady. Erpina! She has ventured forth. Alas, and alack, all I can do now is wait for her return. I think he's getting sleepy. Oh, milady. Mondo, what are you doing here? What are you talking about? I, Mondo, would never consider leaving before you returned. I doubted that you would even wait this long, Fee, but I never imagined it could be so hard. I waited for seven days and nights, my lady. Is that all? I lost count after a year went by, though I feel it's been closer to three. Had it really been three years, my lady? You would doubtless be a mature looking woman by now. I haven't changed at all, have I? That's actually a little disappointing. In that case, I suppose my mastery of dual wielding arts was also but a dream. Even if you did not master dual wielding, I am perfectly happy to see you return safely. Do not say such things. The work was so painful, I truly thought I might not survive it. The only thing which kept me going was the thought of Antonius had suffered it in the same way. Perhaps we should engage in battle to see if you truly learned the dual wielding arts? Novice duelist role. Hmm. Dual wield. Allies must equip, equip a dual wield specific role before being able to dual wield. This role enables an ally to dual wield long swords and use text specific to dual wielders. In addition to these specific texts, dual wielders who use standard long sword texts are also able to block in the same round. We'll just do these two then, I guess. Um, 
Enables dual wield and attack damage up M and attack damage up M. So we'll do both those rules. Although this Oh, those are the ones required for the roll. No, we don't care about that. Um Okay. So we finally acquired dual wield. Jeez, that was ridiculous though. That was like a trial and a half going everywhere. I wonder if our uh, person is back now though. Peachy's still on a mission. Hmm. It's too bad we weren't able to take out these guys. You have acquired the skill of dual wielding. You can tell? Your look has not changed, but what hides inside you is completely different. How have you managed to do that in such a short amount of time? I cannot say. Huh, Antonius said the same. I pass on the words I gave to Antonius here. Pina the young should always strive, even if it means facing adversity. I wonder if we should invite this man to travel with, him, with us. Yes, please come with us. I suppose I must make amends for how I misjudged you. I would sacrifice everything for a worthy cause, including my life. All right, so we have someone else who joined us. Um, oh, right, I need to change her. If she's dual wielding, then I need to change her armaments, right? All right, let's try a battle with dual wield to see how this changes things. I'm happy I finally unlocked it though. Jeez, it took forever. Dual cross cut. Ooh, that did a lot. Oh, but I guess it doesn't matter because they have a lot of HP, these people. Okay. So, we should be doing this. able to kill her this round though, which is good-ish. Actually, we're gonna go back. Because this way we can get an attack in from this guy too. No, don't mesmerize him! Ah, bastard. I did it. Will we get a united attack even though he's sleeping? Oh, I guess we do. Nice. I was not expecting that. Died. My thanks to you, oh, we learned a new ability though, Place Dual Whirlwind. Wow, that did actually quite a bit of damage. No, don't mesmerize him! Good. Disgraceful. Block. Try that. See if we can win here. Problem is, I think he's gonna kill the one. Okay, good. He didn't attack the one. Jeez, so much damage. All right, that worked out pretty well. So I kind of like the dual wielding. I think it might have been worth it. I love this sense of improvement. I'd rather my 
arms not get too burly. And this should increase the lightning incantation. Oh, it didn't rank up? Hmm, that's disappointing. I thought it would. Okay, so I don't think there's really anything left to do. We recruited the guy. Something weird with like the festival stage and... I don't know, the fairy stone, but nothing for us to do. I guess we should probably just return back to what we were doing. We learned the dual wielding like we wanted to. Oh, the seal's back! Let's shoo him away. There's a seal on the coast. That's a rather place fine one. Chase it away! Go, oh, shoo, 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 shoo! Hee 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 hee. Alright, how do we get back? I'll probably just have to tell Mondo to send us back, I guess. Yeah, we can't do anything about those guys, so... I feel like we could have recruited more of the people here, but we managed to get two, which is pretty good. We got Chi-Chi and the old man. Alright. Yes, let's return to Senes Sarah's Nafe. Because we got our dual wield. Mm, too much time has passed, Mondo. I hope Antonius is yet well. There must be a good reason for why they spirited your brother away. If all they wanted was his life, they would have taken that as they wished. Your words provide no comfort, I fear. I'm uneasy not knowing what they want. Oh no, and the stupid thing is back with us! Oh. Does it look different? No, I think it's the same. Ah, but that's frustrating. Anyways, we'll take a break here. Next time we'll continue looking for our brother Antonius. Uh, so as always, thanks for watching. Until next time.